the concept of safety net dental clinics started emerging, say, 10, 15 years ago in the state as a way of augmenting the private practice's struggle to serve a population that is um, often at high risk, often geographically uh, isolated, and even maybe culturally different than what the mainstream uh, delivery is accustomed to. And about 15 years ago, this lack of access started really deteriorating the health of uh, the public health of the entire region. And a number of community leaders got together to say something needs to change. Employers were seeing lack of productivity. It would take two days to get to a dental appointment, say, or take a whole day off to get a child 200 miles away for a dental appointment. The school, uh, the nurses would come to, a, to this uh, group of people talking about the situation, say, kids, the kid, school nurses, they're dealing with toothaches now and families that can't find appointments. And the same thing as if it's hard for a child to learn when they can't, when they're not fed, it's hard for a child to learn with a toothache. Mm -hmm.